pandemic, stay at home. I'm going nuts. In 2017, I put out a video from one of my very favorite sections of the trail. It is from the Superior Hiking Trail going from Finland down to Beaver Bay. Uh, I used some music from Eddie Vedder and YouTube and Eddie didn't care for me using that music and it got blocked. I'm re-editing and publishing that video and I hope that you enjoy. <laughs> Back for some skullduggery on the Superior Hiking Trail. Woohoo! Labor Day weekend, I'm going to be hiking about 30 miles from Finland Rec Center down to Beaver Bay. Beautiful weather. Need to shed some pounds from a day of feasting at the State Fair. It's going to be awesome. All right, as you can see, mud one, Jeremy zero. I just went down in the mud. Just trying to hike through here. Tried to step on a log and skip forward. Sunk in to my, butt up to my knee. Went flat on my, went flat on my face. Nothing hurt other than my ego. Not gonna have to worry about trying to avoid all the mud coming up here since I'm already all wet. walk here on County Road 6 just a little maybe a third of a mile not too bad couldn't really talk to you over on uh, section 13 and that overlook up there is really windy but wow it's one of the best spots on the trail you should come see it it's 
about 145 in the afternoon. I have about four and a half miles till I get to my campsite for the night. So for me, that's probably about two, two and a half hours of hiking. Beautiful weather out here. Probably in the 70s, nice breeze, sun is out. Uh, gonna do a steep climb right now though, so let's get after. Made it to Kennedy Creek. As you can see, it is a great water source. Camped here last year as well. Um, the water was fine then as well. I am in the West Kennedy campsite. Last year I was in the East uh, campsite that's just a tenth of a mile down the trail sharing the uh, campsite with a few other hikers with a dog oh! that is Finn welcoming me to the campsite <laughs> along with Tim and Ryan and Andrea everybody's making dinner Andrea had an encounter with a bear today yep first hopefully I've my whole life. You want to tell everybody what happened? Um, I saw a bear when I turned a corner and it was bigger than I thought bears were going to be. It... Whoop. Oh no! Uh oh. The, the bear story the bear. is too good! <laughs> <laughs> Disaster! Well, 
Hmm. Yeah. We'll get some more water. I'll clean up. <laughs> <laughs> have you got it all on film? I didn't get it on film. I should have, though. <laughs> So the bear. So the bear, so the bear yeah. The bear story is very scary, but yeah, I turned the corner and there it was, and I made some noise and maybe said a swear word or two and <laughs> ran away. So might have been more scared of me than I was of him. Poor you are very intimidating. I guess so. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yelling and waving my arms, it worked. Good job. So. I don't know if I would have done so well. I may have screamed like a little girl or something. <laughs> I did after. Yeah. <laughs> So my setup here, I have my hammock like usual, the uh, war bonnet uh, Blackbird XLC with the Superfly tarp and the do-it-yourself under quilt and top quilt made from Costco quilts. So. Uh, making dinner right now. Gonna hit hit the sack here. Have a great day tomorrow. All right, day two, back on the trail. Beautiful morning, about 7.30. Probably about 55 degrees. Hiking about 10 miles today through Tetaguchi State Park, south down towards Bear Lake. Uh, looking forward to it, got an early start. Um, hopefully I can get to camp a little bit earlier. So I've come to the infamous drain pipe. The drain pipe is one of the steepest parts of the Superior Hiking Trail. I'll try to show you how steep it is. So sometimes it's really difficult to show how steep the drain pipe is. According to my phone, it looks like it's about 50 degrees, so a little over 45 degrees. That's about how steep it is.
Bear Lake. Woo, buddy! All right, so I went down to the Bear Lake campsite, which was down by where I was swimming, and the book says there's four campsites. I only saw two. I didn't see any that would work good for haying hammocks. So they have this, uh, I don't think it's an official campsite, but it's quite large group campsite up here that uh, I decided to stay at. Got to Silver Bay. Use the facilities up there. It's been a really muddy hike this morning. It's kind of windy, as you can probably hear. Uh, looks like I have about 4.7 miles left to go. So I'm at the North Beaver campsite, and this is just a beautiful sight. You can see that you're right along the Beaver River. Down the ways where those waterfalls. Nice campfire ring. Lots of trees for hanging a hammock. This site isn't very far away from the trailhead. So if you were coming up on a Friday night, you could hike in here quickly uh, and set up. 
without having to hike too far. So